Hello and welcome to the Christmas Everyday Club. Today we're looking at Autumn Reese's Christmas movies. Now she's only been in four, but some of these movies are some of my favourites, guys. So, let's get into it. But if you are a fan of Autumn Reese's, let us know in the comments below. If we miss any off, let us also know. We're not perfect, guys, but let's get into this, yes? And this first one, well, even though it's not technically a Christmas movie... It's got Santa in it, it's got Christmas decorations in it, and it's more or less near Christmas. And it's a really good movie, guys. I only watched it the other day, and I really enjoyed it. And it's called Love at the Thanksgiving Day Parade, which came out in 2012. An eager Thanksgiving parade coordinator is shocked when a wealthy consultant is hired to analyse its finances. Faced with teaching him that the parade means so much more to her than money, she finds herself reluctantly falling for him. But did you know, a bit trivia, yeah, if you listen to the background music, it reminds of the background music in the Matt Helm films of the 60s. Bit of goose as well. While observing the practice of one of the bands, Emily is eating fruit. She's waving around a piece of melon and it suddenly turns into a grape. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I really enjoy that movie, guys. It's fun and it's, it's romantic as well, guys. It's really nice. Then we have... A Bramble House Christmas, which came out in 2017. Finn Conrad becomes suspicious as to why his father left a nurse named Will Willa £100,000 or dollars and goes undercover to investigate. When she discover when he when he discovers his true identity, will it keep her from ever trusting him again? A bit of trivia as well, the male lead character's name in the movie is Finn. In real life, Autumn Rita's son name is also Finn. Bit of goose as well. The continual continuity of the skating scene was actually not wrong. They were skating in an indoor rink. The overhead lights were out and the Xmas lights were on. Then we have Christmas Under the Stars. Came out in 2019. I really enjoyed this movie, guys. When Nick, a career-focused investment banker, is fired from his high-powered firm at Christmas time, he takes a job at the Christmas tree lot owned by a warm-hearted widower. There, he meets Julie, an astronomer teacher who's always looked to the stars for hope. As the Christmas spirit washes over him, and he begins falling for Julie, the once self-centred Nick discovers the joy of helping others. This is why I like it, guys. I like movies like this. Did you know a bit of trivia, though? Autumn Risa and Jesse Metcalf were co-stars in the 2015 Hallmark movie, A Country Wedding. It's also a good movie, guys. Bit of goose as well. When Mrs. Gibbons sees the planets hanging from Mia's room, she comments they are spaced right, meaning like they're set up correctly, yeah? It's to scale, but they can't be to scale and, and spaced right. And neither is true, yeah? Because at the approximate scale of Jupiter as shown, 10 inches, Neptune would be over 4 miles away and only 3 inches in size. But, guys, it's only a movie. Uh, late, the last one she was starring, guys, um, is a Glenbrook, Glenbrook Christmas, what came out in 2020, yeah? As Christmas nears, high-res Jessica Morgan seizes what seems like her last chance to experience a relaxed Christmas and heads off to a small town of Glenbrook, where she meets a handsome fireman. But did you know, a bit of trivia, yeah, this movie is the fourth that Orson Risa and Antonio Cooper have starred in together bit of goose as well. Towards the end, the main character has her phone in a cradle on the car and pushes to answer a call. The push causes the phone to concave, showing it as fake plastic. I didn't, I didn't notice that, guys. Doesn't matter. But that's it, guys. Um, she's not actually starring in a movie this year, in 2022, which is a shame because I like Autumn Lisa. Um, and that concludes our list guys uh, of awesome Reese's Christmas movies be sure to let us know what your favourite movie is down in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one check out the other ones as well guys and if you um, enjoy it please give us a thumbs up and until, until next time thanks very much for watching goodbye